I am live. What is going on, guys? Welcome to the video. My name is Brando Linick, and you're looking for how to start an auto detailing business. It's a really awesome search. This is something I've actually done. And um, long story short, without trying to bore you, um, it's a simple business to start. It's actually not all that complicated. I started it going back about three and a half, almost four years ago as one of my first business ventures. I started it because it was simple and you can actually get started once you have your business license and it's registered, you want to make sure that it's legal and you can operate. Once you have that down, you can actually operate right out of your driveway if you want to start that way. You can put some ads up on Craigslist and you can get going just like that. And that's essentially how you can actually start and get one going. Now, I want to make this very clear. <laughs> if you're looking at starting an auto detailing business because you want to be your own boss and you're looking at it for very similar reasons why I had looked at it, because I want to be my own boss, I want to make money, and I wanted leverage and time freedom and control of my income, if that's why you're looking at it, very similar reasons, I'd actually advise you before you consider starting an auto detailing business, if those are kind of similar reasons why you're looking at it, if you're not looking at it because you want to franchise it out, which franchising it's just going to mean you're going to have more you know, equipment, more supplies, more employees, which isn't that big of a deal because it's not that much overhead, but managing all that, it can take up so much of your time where you're not spending time with your family as often, you're not being able to take vacations as often, and it's not to say it's bad, it's just what goes with the territory if you were to franchise it out. And I'm only saying franchising because when it's just you building the business, this is something I realized after a while, it was about like six months in. When it's just you building the business, okay, you can only detail so many cars. You can only, you know, do stuff so often throughout the day, which means if you only can detail one car every two hours, that means it limits the amount of money that you can make. It limits you, all right? It caps you pretty much. And when you have a franchise, it doesn't limit you as often. That's why I brought that up, because if you're looking at this to build a business to be your own boss, it's something you've got to be aware of, because it limits the amount of profit you can make. So that's why I share that with you. Um, but the, if you are looking at this because you want to be your own boss, you want to create time, freedom, leverage, create your own income, before you consider it, I've got to lead on a theory of weight. And if you hear me out here for just a minute, my experience with this goes back a year ago when I transitioned from traditional business, came across a person uh, who was building a business in a way where they had time, freedom, leverage, flexibility, traveling around the world, building a business at the same time, making a high multiple six-figure income business without supplies, without equipment, using systems to where they could take a vacation, where they could travel and still be able to maintain their income and grow their business using systems online. And because they were building a business online, all right, I started to model and copy what they're doing. Less than 30 days later, I'm not guaranteeing you results. I'm not promising you results. I'm just sharing with you what's possible. I was able to work my butt off, learn some things, all right, apply a good work ethic, work very strategically, and create a full-time income business working part-time. Less than 30 days, which is not average or typical. I'm not average or typical, but if you're wanting to start a business that's simple, one you know you can make money at, if that's really what you're looking for, learn to build a business on the internet where you can create leverage, where you can create flexibility, time freedom, to be able to do what you're passionate about, whether that passion is traveling the world, whether it's learning a new language, whether it's moving into a new neighborhood. So I hope this makes sense from a business perspective, just sharing with you my experience as well onto it. And uh, you know, I look forward to seeing your success story. I look forward to seeing you on the beaches of the world. And you know, if you'd like to learn more information about how to build a business online, if you're wondering, well Brando, how can I do that? If you're coachable, if you're willing to learn some things, not afraid of some work, connect with me on my site. Check it out. It's 123marketingtips.com. I'll put a link in the description, and uh, I'll personally connect with you from there. But aside from that, whatever road you decide to take, I'll bless you on the way out, and I'll see you on the beaches of the world regardless. Take care.